In this video, we'll talk about dangers of getting stuck in the past. When you have refused to start over, you are endangering yourself in various ways. As earlier mentioned, it can make you lose sight of the opportunities around you. This chapter explores what you stand to lose when you're stuck in the past. Depression. According to the World Health Organization, depression is a leading psychological problem affecting millions of people around the world. Note that depression is different from the occasional mood swings we have because of an unpleasant event. Depression is more intense and persistent than that. When you are depressed, you will not want to talk to anyone. You will prefer to stay in your bed rather than go out and have social interactions. At that moment, everything in the world becomes colorless and tasteless to you. Note that depression can become fatal in the long run. It can lead to suicidal ideation. In other words, depression can make you feel like taking your own life. Meanwhile, you should never get to that point. There is nothing worth it in this world that should make you feel that taking your life is the best option. As long as you are still alive, you can still rewrite your story. No one is denying that you were hurt, but you cannot get stuck in the past. The price can be too costly. Guilt. Guilt can become a serious issue when you feel that you could have done things differently. It is that feeling you have when you're at fault. You wish you didn't make the choice that led to the disastrous outcome, and it is weighing down on you. According to Socrates, an unchecked life is not worthwhile. So it is normal that you think about your mistakes and learn from them so that you can be better prepared for future events. However, it is a problem when you cannot let go of the negative emotions you have from that experience. Note that you cannot separate guilt from depression. In other words, when you are feeling bad about yourself because of your past mistakes, you can eventually become depressed. Remember that depression can lead to suicide suicidal thoughts. So you will be doing yourself a lot of good by letting go of the past. It's good that you're not happy about your mistakes. Nevertheless, you need to move on. Shame. You can feel ashamed of yourself due to moral failure. For example, if you cheated on your partner, you might feel bad about that action for a long time, especially if that person broke up with you because of that. In the same way, you might feel ashamed if your personal sex clip was uploaded on social media. No one can deny that these situations will make you stigmatized for a while. Nonetheless, your story is not ended unless you decided to quit. It is noteworthy that no man can walk out of his own story. You have to end it somewhere, somehow. You can either choose to stand up and heal your wound or choose to be defined by your past mistakes. The truth is that there are people out there who are still willing to give you an opportunity to prove yourself. However, you will miss those opportunities when you keep thinking that you don't deserve to be loved and respected because of what you did in the past. Lack of focus. It is challenging to be focused when you are thinking about the past. You will struggle to make plans or set goals because you are still thinking about what could have been. This situation is common to people who are close to achieving something monumental, but it didn't work out eventually. So they feel that it is not likely they can get it right again. It's not true that you cannot achieve success again because things went south the last time. However, you need to be focused. Don't let a sour relationship make you a monster. Stop saying things that you can never love anyone like you loved your ex again. You're only reacting because you felt bad about the heartbreak. In the same way, you should not be lackadaisical in your attitude in your new job because your last boss treated you badly. You have a new opportunity to rewrite your story. Don't ruin it. Poor performance. You cannot be at your best when you're not emotionally stable. People going through heartbreaks often find it is difficult to perform at the same level they used to perform before the incident. When you allow the thoughts of your mistakes or a negative event in the past to keep coming at you, you will either be slow while executing a project or carry it out shabbily. Besides, you will not be present in the moment. You will just be doing things just to get by because you are emotionally disturbed. So the sooner you banish the memory of the past and focus on the present, the better for you. The demands of the modern world require that you are focused. If you are working with a ruthless boss, you will be dismissed if you are not producing as expected. That will only make things worse for you. Low Motivation the importance of motivation cannot be overemphasized in any activity. You cannot perform at a high level when you're not inspired to work. When you refuse to move on and start over, you will not have the passion to give in your best. It can be disastrous when you are doing a job that requires meticulousness and attention to detail, like the medical profession. Your lack of focus and motivation can lead to a costly mistake that can ruin your career or put an indelible mark on it. It could also lead to litigations, which does not bode well for your reputation and brand image. So, it is in your best interest to let go of the emotional entanglements and focus on the task at hand. Anxiety Just like depression, anxiety is another psychological problem facing many people in the world. The advent of social media has made it the order of the day due to excessive exposure to traumatic events and insensitive comments. 
However, social media exposure is not the only source of anxiety in the world. You can also be anxious when you keep remembering your past mistakes. This anxiety can come especially when you're about to carry out a similar task. You might be scared that you will make mistakes again that will lead to another abject performance. Substance abuse. Many people, especially youths, turn to drugs and other substances like alcohol to relieve stress and anxiety. Depressed people also often abuse drugs and alcohol because they're trying to feel better. These substances might offer you short-term relief. However, they will take their toll on your physical and mental health in the long run. You can become addicted to them such that you will not be able to live a normal life unless you take alcohol. Once you get to that point, you are in trouble because you can become more violent and aggressive, which will affect your relationships. Physical illness. Whatever affects your mental health will eventually affect your physical health if you don't act fast. If you keep thinking about the past, you will become depressed. Meanwhile, when you're not in a good mood, you will develop poor eating habits and will not be motivated to work out. In the long run, you can fall sick due to your unhealthy practices, so you will not gain anything by being stuck in the past. The disadvantages and dangers of not starting over are more than the ones listed in this video course. These ones are highlighted so that you can realize that you have a lot to lose when you are stuck in the past. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.